This is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com at the 2022 Amelia Island Concourse. This is the Saturday morning Cars and Coffee. Just a normal everyday Cars and Coffee. Wouldn't you agree? Check out that absolutely outrageous Belvedere. What do we have? Let me get out of here. Look at this thing. Judy Lilly's original factory uh, super stock 67426. Four speed Belvedere. Oof. What I love about these cars manual brakes, manual steering. We don't need anything fancy. Oh. Nice green briar. All right, I'll show you inside. Excuse me? Thank you. Let's see if I get it. No, I can't. There we go. Pull down here. Nice. Cool. Love this. Tribute to Shelby Daytona. The Green Briar. I always enjoy the Green Briars. Very rare truck. Corvair only had them for a few years. You can see the crank down, center windows. I like the seating arrangements in here. XK120. Fiat Multiplia. This is just beautiful. I'm going to show you the powerful engine. How big is it? It's seven and a half gallons. But I get about 35 to 40 miles a gallon. That's good. That's a small That little four cylinder. So that's the big block, right? Oh, no, that's the big carburetor. The one that was on there was smaller. <laughs> <laughs> this car originally was a 633cc, making about 23 horsepower. Wow. And it had six seats. So do the math. <laughs> well, just so. pick up small people. Yeah. There you go. Italians it. are generally small, so. Surprising so. with all that pasta. <laughs> How much horsepower is this thing? Uh, I don't really know. This Again, cars and coffee. Nice little Ferrari. Of these 308s. These were ignored for so long. Viper. Oh, Challenger RT. Yes, I know you guys really love them, so I'm going to zoom in over here. This girl's driven, which is nice. Look at this. All original. I love it. Those fenders look like they've never been off. At least this one has power brakes. Probably drum all the way around. Oh, look at this. Oh, and look at those seat covers. That's why. But check out the alligator roof. Man, SE, very unusual. That is cool. Look at this girl. And again, you could tell it's original. The insane orange peel in there. That was typical of the era. I mean, this car is magnificent. She was definitely work, but she survived so brilliantly. This is the way the cars would look back in the day. Not the super restore that you see today. Lovely. So Shelby shedding her top. Continental Mark II, of course. Aston Martin. Sex on wheels. Again, this is just the cars and coffee. This is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com at the 2022 Amelia Island Concourse d'Elegance.
Ah, oh, look at this stuff. This is great. Land Cruiser, the original 600 of hood. These things were virtually bulletproof. We've got three day Tommaso Panteras. Four, pardon me, four. Wow. That is amazing. I'm going to end it in a few minutes because we're getting some music coming in and I really want to break away. Nice Mercedes. And again, very proper for here with the top down, 71-280 SE. The fuel injection was really coming on strong at that point. It really made them better cars. Oh, that's beautiful. Automatic, air conditioning. Very nice Florida car. I want to show you a detail on these bends. Look at the wood. And that bezel is all wood. Is that cool? A little right-hand drive Mini. This was imported from Japan. The reason why she imported it from Japan is because it had air conditioning. And next to it is the Auto Bianchi Abar, the Mini supercar. That is a reproduction of a French microcar, the 36 La Cabre, La Cabre. I probably butchered it. Again, this is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com at the 2022 Amelia Island Concourse d'Elegance Cars and Coffee. For more cool events like this, make sure you check your car show calendars, NortheastWheelsEvents.com, SoutheastWheelsEvents.com, UKWheelsEvents.com, and while you're there, post and share your events. And if you like this video, make sure you click subscribe and share it with your friends. I'll see you at the shows.